you know our next guest from the movies Hidden Figures and The Dark Knight Rises. Now you like you've never seen him before as a well-oiled graduate of the Tom Cruise School of Aviation in the highly anticipated Top Gun Maverick. I can't be the only one that knows that Maverick flew with his old Lieutenant, man. That's enough. Or that Maverick was flying when his old man. Lieutenant, that's enough. That's enough. You son of a bitch. Come on. I'm cool. I'm cool. Hey, hey, hey. That's enough. He's not cut out for this mission. It's enough. You know it. You know I'm right. Top Gun Maverick opens in theaters May 27th. Say hello to Glenn Powell. Hey, Glenn. How are you? Come on, man. Now, Glenn, I'm sorry. I, originally, you're supposed to be in here in studio tonight, but you're being uh, extra cautious, correct? Yeah, you know, better better to be safe than sorry. Now, I just want to, just for the record, you're not being extra cautious because of, you're afraid of getting something from me. Look, at the end of the day, you know, you canceled on Tom, I cancel on you. You gotta, you can't reward bad behavior, you know? <laughs> you know, uh, I saw a Top Gun Maverick, and it's, first of all, great, and you are great, and you play uh, this hotshot fighter pilot. Uh, what's your nickname in the, Hangman is your nickname. Hangman. Yeah. Now, Miles Teller was here uh, the week before last. He said he got to pick his nickname, which is Rooster. Did you pick Hangman? Yeah, I got to pick Hangman. Um, you know, when we originally, we went to the Navy, went to Fallon, Nevada, and hung with all the Navy people. And uh, the, my original call sign was Slayer. And when they were talking about the difference between Air Force call signs and Navy call signs, they said, you know, Navy call signs are like Peanut and Zaddy. And like Air Force call signs are like Spine Ripper and Slayer. And I was like, well, I can't be an Air Force call sign. So... I went down to North Island, hung with a bunch of naval aviators, and uh, I met this one guy whose call sign was Noose. And I was like, hey, why do they call you Noose, man? And he goes, ah, you know, and then his buddy's like, I'll tell you why they call him Noose. And basically they said, you know, when he was in middle school, he was going to go to a school dance. He was really excited. Uh, there was this girl he really liked, but he was worried he was going to be too excited. So he ended up taking his shoelace and tying it around his thing, around his leg. <laughs> <laughs> and <laughs> so you take a shoelace, you Wait. tie it around your leg. Not a great plan to start off with. Uh, it got stuck. Um, his buddy had to cut him out. So he got the call sign, Noose. Wow. <laughs> and Noose became Hangman. Wow. Should somebody who makes a decision like that be flying a jet? <laughs> wow. Yeah. That I, is I a great story. I'm so proud of our Navy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> who in your life is most excited about you being in this movie? You know, I got to say, um, I just got to take my dad to the premiere of Top Gun. Um, my dad introduced me to Top Gun when I was 10 years old. Um, I remember him giving me the VHS like he was bringing something down from Mount Sinai. Like he just uh. was like, this is the tablet. Um, and I remember like we, we watched, when we put the VHS in, he looked at me, he just didn't stop watching me the whole time we were watching Top Gun. And it just, it just reminds you that Top Gun just, it's a rite of passage for people. People just love this movie and it holds such a special place. And you've seen it. This movie just is awesome, and it just builds on what was already there. But my dad was, uh, my dad loved this movie. Did your dad get to meet Tom Cruise at the premiere? My dad's in the movie. Your dad's um, in the movie. Oh, you put your I mean, parents in your movies, right? You told me that yeah, last time. Yeah. It's like a thing. It, it started off as like a fun joke, and now it's like an expectation. Oh. Um, <laughs> <laughs> So my dad, so my dad's in the movie. Like I uh, originally brought like some friends and my family to to set, and they were all in flight suits, getting to do the thing. Um, and then I get to introduce them to Tom, and Tom's just amazing, telling stories and making everybody feel welcome. Um, so I go off to craft services. I feel confident that it's all going well, and I come back, and on there's four cameras going, and on all four cameras at Video Village, my dad is on all four cameras while they're like, shooting. Oh no. I was like, this is bad. So I go and I, and I walk in there and I look at Tom and Tom's just got this like goofy smile on his face. He's so excited. 
And I was like, hey, is everything good? And he's like, the only guy who knows how to find a lens better than you is your dad. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Wow. That's yeah. exciting. Wow. So, oh, so they're in, uh, which scene are they in, your, your family? Um, so, so when Miles Teller is playing Great Balls of Fire on the piano. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Right behind him, he's putting out a tour de force performance. He nails it. Oh, we have every to look. beat. Yeah. That's yeah. great. You'll see him in award season for sure. You know, Miles said that um, a lot of the actors threw up while they were flying and that he was not one of the vomiters. Um, uh, did you vomit? Were you one of the vomiters? Yeah, that's a, that's a great wingman to throw other people under the bus. Uh, yeah. Miles Teller. <laughs> no, no, I do love Miles. Um, you know, I threw up a lot. <laughs> um, you know, Tom, when it, when it comes to uh, Tom Cruise, like Tom wants to do everything legit all right. the way through. Uh, so we were up in the back of planes this entire movie, in the back of real F-18s. And, uh, you know, if you want to get a sense of like Top Gun, we were, there was like this one day where we were basically flying through the canyons. It's called Star Wars Canyons, this really famous run. We're flying like 100 feet off the ground, 500 knots, weaving through these canyons. You invert, you reorient, you come back, you drop a bomb, you pull up seven and a half Gs, and you're doing it over and over and over. And uh, at one point I was like, okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to puke. Uh, so I, I tried to sneak my vomit bag because I didn't want to embarrass myself in front of this naval aviator. These guys are tough. They're cool. And I'm like the actor in the back of the plane. I didn't want to be that guy. So I just said, hey, you know, Fisty, um, you know, why don't we just settle out? Like, I just want to check out the view. And he's like, you good back there, man? I'm like, no, nah, man, I'm, I'm, I'm good, man. I'm just like, uh, I'll be ready to rock and roll. Just, you know, give me a second. And I just start violently puking in this bag. Um, but the problem is the microphone is also the mask. So I ripped off my mask and he didn't hear the last part. Um, so as I'm violently puking in this bag, I just hear in my, my comms, well, buddy, if you're ready to rock and roll, let's rock and roll. And he just inverts the plane, pulls down. And so I'm like just puking into the canopy. <laughs> and so I'm like looking at the ground here and the puke that I just puked is being puked back into my face. Oh, all right. Well, so it's a um, recirculation. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like re recycle, reduce, reuse. Yeah, I, um, but that's what, that's what it's like to make Top Gun. And then what you know? happens when they land the plane? Is there a person who comes and hoses it out or do you have to clean that out yourself? You know, the Navy has been good to us, and I really, <laughs> I, I don't think we're going to make a sequel uh, because of this reason. It's probably well, just me. Well, people yeah. are going to, I think it was worth your vomiting because people are going to love it. It's Top Gun Maverick. It opens in theaters May 27th. Thanks, Glenn. Glenn Powell, everybody. We'll be back with St. Paul and the Broken Bones. Congratulations on making it to the end of a YouTube video. Why not celebrate by clicking the subscribe button? You earned it.